Hello, I'm Ashlyn and I'm also Mama Bear Fitness and I wanted to share how I became Mama Bear Fitness and why I decided to do more, do more for me. So back in 2013, I found out my children, right here, the little girls were sexually abused by someone that we trusted, someone that we loved, and it was absolutely devastating. I took two weeks to just swallow, like this just happened, and absorb what was happening and to defend my children like a mama bear. I got them into therapy. We got all the help that they needed. Um, the police got involved and they were taken care of. And within those two weeks, I realized that as a mother of these two little girls, I had to do something to cope or I was going to go crazy. I was reading every book I could find on what to do as a parent, how to prevent, how to make it so that they are not affected for their whole life. I was like going crazy. <laughs> so I went to the gym. I got a pass the first week in January, like a cliche, and devoted my time four times a week, four to five times a week, doing pump classes and spin classes. And I was consistent. I had a gym buddy and we would go and I was like blinders. I would go, I would do my class and then I would leave. <laughs> I wouldn't talk to anyone. And um, I didn't see much change in my body. However, it did everything that I wanted it to. I would go and I would have workouts where I cried, where those emotions were just pouring out of me. The frustration, the anger, and the pain was just there, and I was letting it go. So it was everything that I needed, everything. And those girls right there are awesome today. They are not in therapy anymore. They don't need it, but when they do, they tell me. They're strong, and they're advocates for helping other children, which I am incredibly proud of. They're not ashamed of what's happened to them, and they know it wasn't their fault. So I've empowered my little girls by um, just feeding my brain with knowledge, right? Knowledge is power. So uh, a year and a half comes and goes, and I realize my body hasn't changed a bit. I'm naturally thin, but I have no change in my muscle definition, my stomach, and I just thought, well, that's kind of lame. Like now that it's like, yes, I've got everything I wanted out of it emotionally. Well. Shouldn't I have a physical change too, right? Well, I was still eating like handfuls of Swedish fish and bread and basically junk. Like, I don't know that I ate a vegetable within three days. So um, I decided, my husband worked for Beachbody Corporate, that I was going to actually do a program that they sold. Wow. Like, wow. Why wouldn't I do that before? I don't know. But I was like, too cool for that. I'm not going to drink the Shakeology. I'm not going to do any of that stuff because it's for those people not for me. So uh, that all happens and I start 21 day fix and within three days I have abs. And I'm like, what the heck? I worked a year and a half and saw nothing in three days and I saw abs. So uh, it was exciting to me and I thought, okay, well, uh, I, I think I want to do this. I want to be a coach. I want to help other people see what it can do emotionally. I want to help people cope and get through hard things because most of you know I've had some hard things. Um, our marriage, as a mother, as a woman. And for me to find my own empowering happiness, my um, strength, it has been with this, healthy living. So it's pretty simple. I only work out 30 minutes, 40 minutes a day, six days a week. So it, I remember hearing that and thinking like, that's still a lot. Like, I don't want to work out that much. That's like crazy. That's addicted to exercise. Well, I'm calling myself a lazy fitness addict, guys. I am addicted to the consistency. My husband now works out with me as part of his own recovery, and it's amazing. The connection that we have as a family every morning, our kids are there with us, and they may be dancing, and we may be working out, but we're there. And uh, even if our bodies aren't changing hugely, we don't have a beach body 
we are here and we are married, we are happy and we feel good. Like you feel good in the inside and that's what I want for other people. That's why I do what I do. That's why I'm the weirdo who's posting my workout videos and my what I ate today. Like I'm that person and it feels good and I'm, it's crazy to me. I just, I never saw myself like this, but I'm also stronger and happier than I ever imagined, and I'm a dork because I'm crying, but honestly, why not do something that makes you feel good when you're surrounded by people who are also wanting to make people feel good? There's no gimmick in it. If it, if it were a quick fix or easy, then we'd all be like super fit, right? No, it's hard work. There's still hangups that we have and, and emotional eating that we deal with. Um, we're not perfect as coaches, but it sure is great, and it's pretty awesome that I get to do it at home with my husband and my two little girls by my side. So for that, I am Mama Bear.